Hello, good morning, and welcome to story time at the Lawrenceburg Public Library. I am Ms. Megan, and today we are talking about fall. It is fall outside. If you look outside, you'll see the leaves are falling from the trees. That's why we call it fall. So this season um, is about, uh, it's about, yeah, it's about leaves falling from the, from the trees. <laughs> um, okay, so before we get to talking about, about fall and about leaves, we have to do one thing before we start anything in story time, and that is shake our sillies out. Are you ready? Here we go. One, two, three. We got to shake, shake, shake our sillies out, shake, shake. Shake your sillies out, shake, shake, shake your sillies out, wiggle or waggles away. We gotta clap, clap, clap our crazies out, clap, clap, clap our crazies out, clap, clap, clap our crazies out, wiggle or waggles away. We gotta jump, jump, jump our jiggles out, jump, jump, jump our jiggles out, jump, jump, jump our jiggles out, wiggle or waggles away. We gotta yawn. Yawn, sleepy zone, yawn, 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 our sleepy zone, yawn, 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 our sleepy zone, and wiggle our waggles away. We gotta shake, shake, shake our sailies out, shake, shake, shake our sailies out, shake, shake, shake our sailies out, and wiggle our waggles away. Hey! Great job, everyone! Great job singing and shaking all of your sillies out. Good job. Okay, today's early literacy tip is about vocabulary. Vocabulary is a big word that just means words. So vocabulary is your child's ability to know the names of things and emotions and concepts and ideas. So books give us tons of opportunity to expand our vocabulary. It's easier for children to read words that they have already heard. So try to expose them to as many words as you can. Um, and talk to your child, even if they're little babies and they don't really understand what you're saying, um, it doesn't matter uh, because talking to them helps them hear words and it helps them uh, build vocabulary so they can learn how to speak and then read faster. Okay, cool, cool, cool. It's time to get into our first story. It's called A Fall Ball for All. It's about all the, these animals in the forest getting ready for the fall ball. Okay, let's get started. A fall ball for all. Once upon a golden day, autumn wind blew into play, whooshing leaves into the air, orange, brown, purple, everywhere. You have the autumn breeze. Do you see the leaves blowing right here? At every burrow, den, and nest, an invitation fell to rest. You're invited, one and all, to the annual windfall ball. All the animals are invited to a ball? What's a ball? Like a bouncy ball? Hmm, no. A ball, like this type of ball, is like a dance, like an event. Geese postponed their grand migration. Bears and bats, their hibernation. Excitement for the party grew from great gray owl to the smallest shrew. The creatures donned their autumn best, fur and feather primped and pressed. Coyote groomed, pheasant preened, porcupine shook, and otter cleaned. So the leaves are blowing and they're gonna go all the way to the ball. The nights grew longer into fall as autumn wind prepared the ball. Squalls sent pumpkins tumbling round and a breeze shook apples to the ground. Ooh, gusts and gales and tempest forces Set a fete with seven courses, cranberries, chestnuts, corn and plums, sunflowers, daisies, and chrysanthemums. 
put all of the food. It's like Thanksgiving. Now it's nighttime. Harvest moon sets the night aglow. Guests arrived, some fast, some slow. Rabbit and turtle tapped a beat. Soon the night, uh, as wind composed an autumn sweet. Soon the night was filled with song, a blustery chorus sang along. I was having fun at the autumn ball. Then autumn wind began to dance. It breezed, it blew, it puffed, it pranced, beckoning both big and small to join in step at the windfall ball. Well, the animals are going to start dancing. Turkey strutted, and with elk and quail, beaver kept time with his tail. A swirling night of celebration, windy, joyful jubilation. Everyone's dancing. In the shindig's happy wake, an autumn treasure for all to take. A windfall feast, a winter's cash to gobble, bury, store, or stash. Now they all have a whole bunch of food for the winter. Chipmunks filled their furry cheeks, and raccoons took pumpkins, corn, and leeks. Then Badger raised one final toast for all who gathered and their host. And every burrow, hill, and nest was ready for a winter's rest. Autumn waved goodbye to all until the next year's windfall ball. So there's Autumn waving goodbye. There we go. That's the end. Good job. Yay. Excellent work. I really like the rhymes in that one. So uh, it's another week where we talk about, um, um, what is it called? Phonological awareness. That's not our tip for today. Our tip today is, is for vocabulary, but rhymes are really good for phonological awareness. Um, okay, so great job, everyone. Okay, so now let's sing, um, let's sing a song, okay? It's pretty easy. Here we go. Follow with me. Leaves, leaves, leaves will fall gently all around, falling left and falling right, falling to the ground. Okay, follow me and do it one more time with me. One, two, three. Leaves, leaves, leaves will fall gently to the ground, falling left, falling right, falling all around. Good job. Okay. Now, before we get into our our second story, let's do another cool activity, okay? So here I have my felt board. I have five leaves here. One, two, three, four, five. We're going to do a rhyme with um, our five leaves, okay? Let me adjust my camera a little bit. Here we go. Okay. Here's how the rhyme goes. Can you follow with me? Okay. Five little leaves flying by the door. The red leaf flew away. And then there were four. Four little leaves falling down on me. The orange leaf flew away. And then there were Three! Three little leaves falling down on you. The yellow leaf blew away. And then there were one, two. Two little leaves having lots of fun. The green leaf blew away. And then there was one. One little brown leaf sitting in the sun. The little leaf blew away. And then there were nine. Yay, good job. All of our leaves blew away with the help of our rhyme. Okay, guys, good job. It's time for our second story. It's called 
mouse's first fall. If you are a little tiny baby, you are having your very first fall. Hmm, how many falls have you had? Well, think, how old are you? Are you four years old? Are you three years old? If you are three years old, then you have three falls because fall happens once a year. Okay, this is about Mouse's first fall ever. Here we go. Let's see what happens. One cool fall day. Here's the house. We're setting the scene. One cool fall day. Mouse and Minka came out to play. Here's Mouse and here is Minka. Tumbling and twirling, fall leaves fell all around. Look at all of the colors, said Minka. We have yellow and red and brown. Mouse saw red leaves and yellow leaves and orange leaves and brown leaves. So many different colors. Look at all the shapes, said Minka. Look at the shape of this one. It goes like this. And then this one is a different shape. It goes like this. So many different shapes. Mouse saw round leaves and skinny leaves and pointy leaves and smooth leaves. Let's run through the leaves, said Minka, and they run through the leaves. Mouse ran and skipped and kicked and swished through all of the leaves. Let's pile them up, said Minka. Pile up your leaves, pile up your leaves into a big leaf pile. What are they gonna do with their big leaf pile? They're gonna jump in! Mouse piled the leaves high. One, two, three, lots of leaves. What a big pile, said Minka. Let's jump in. Here they go, they're gonna jump in the leaf pile. Mouse leaped and jumped and plopped and rolled into the leaves. You see him playing in the leaves? I'm hiding, called Minka. Can you find me? So here's Mouse, but where is Minka? Hmm, can you see Minka anywhere? Where is Minka? Look, is that a tail? That right there? Yeah, I think she's hiding. Mouse peeked and poked and peered between the leaves. Where could Minka be? Hmm, Mouse is looking for Minka. Where is she? Is that her tail again? I think she's hiding. Then out popped Minka. Here I am. Good job. Hooray for Minka. Hooray for Mouse. Hip, hip, hooray for fall. Yay, the end. Good job, everyone. It was really cool to see her hiding in the leaves and jumping around in a big leaf pile. That's, that is super fun. So if you are outside, you can rake up all your leaves and play in the leaves. It'll be super fun. Okay, guys, it's about time for our goodbye song. But before I do that, I want to show you um, our super cool craft that we have little craft kit kits available for you to come pick up at the Lawrenceburg Public Library at the Youth Services Desk. So you can come and get a cool craft pack to make this cute little tissue paper uh, jack-o'-lantern or just a pumpkin if you think that's cuter. Um, so it's just little pieces of tissue paper and you squish them up and you glue them and you make a cute little pumpkin decoration. Um, so yeah, this craft and the crafts from previous weeks are available at the uh, youth services desk here at the main at the main branch in Lawrenceburg. Um, at the, yeah, I already said at the youth services desk. 
Uh, so you can just come and ask for some crafts and we can give you some cool crafts. And yeah, this one has a this one has a magnet on it. So if you, <laughs> I actually I don't have any magnets included in the craft pack. But if you want to glue it onto the back of one of your magnets, <laughs> then you can stick it on your fridge. Um, okay. So yeah, that's our cool craft that we have. Um, next week our theme will be Halloween. So uh, get ready, get ready for that. That's going to be really fun. Our story, our story time theme is going to be Halloween, and we'll read some spooky, spooky stories. It won't be too spooky. But they'll be they'll be spooky themed. <laughs> um, okay, so yeah, next week will be our Halloween theme, and it will be our last story time until November. No, but good thing is in November we're gonna have in person story time here and at the branch in limited numbers, and you have to register. But it's gonna be very exciting. Okay, so enough uh, enough of my blabbling. It's time for our goodbye song. Are you ready? One, two, three. Goodbye, see you next time, everyone. Goodbye, see you next time, everyone. Goodbye to you, goodbye to you, goodbye to you, goodbye to me. Goodbye, see you next time, everyone. It's being really quiet. Shh. Goodbye, see you next time, everyone. Goodbye, see you next time, everyone. Goodbye to you, goodbye to you, goodbye to you, goodbye to me. Goodbye, see you next time, everyone. Don't sing really loud! Goodbye, see you next time, everyone. Goodbye, see you next time, everyone. Goodbye to you, goodbye to you, goodbye to you, goodbye to me, goodbye, see you next time, everyone. Goodbye!